This is a cart for a sway rising. Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome to Sway. Of course, you know who I am. I am Sway. And as always, I have my trusty smokes, my trusty coke. And this is the channel where I give you my opinion. I give you news. I give you a bunch of stuff. I, And I'm just honest with you when I give you my opinion on how I feel. And does it bother me that people don't agree with me? No, it doesn't. And give me a second as I'm continuing to set up a bit, but I had to uh, I had to record this really quickly. And for noise in the background, I apologize. That's my fan. It's really hot in the studio, uh, <laughs> which is just my room. I don't know. I, don't, I really don't know uh, what else I can talk about it. But before I get started, do not forget to hit the like button, hit the subscribe Hit the notification bell so you can be notified of every time I post a new video. So it happened. It happened. Our big brother at YouTube uh, basically censored me. They removed a video. Wow. They removed a video from my channel, and it's actually the first A Call for a Sway Rising video that I recorded. So, um, in that video, in, in that video, uh, it is pretty interesting because I talk about how am I going to word this without triggering the YouTube algorithms. I was talking about uh, certain biblical aspects, uh, Mark of the Beast stuff, concerning the new medication, the new uh, injections, the new stuff that's being passed around uh, the United States and all over the world. I was giving you uh, my thoughts on it, uh, on the biblical aspect of it. I was uh, also letting you know that some of my experiences on the fact that I haven't taken medication in years. I guess that's the best way I can put it. Um, now, luckily for me, luckily for me, uh, some time ago, I actually started a Rumble channel so I can upload videos there in case I say something that is controversial to the YouTube algorithms. So that video... That video is not lost. That video is not lost. And I will post the link to that video that was deleted in the description box below. Right on my Rumble channel. Okay. And I will be, and uh, I'm going to be posting this on my Rumble channel as well, this video. So um, it, it's really interesting to note that. Um, They said that it was medical misinformation. Now, number one. In that video, I did not give any kind of medical advice. I, in that video, I only talked about uh, what I do. In my personal life, okay? Uh, excuse me. I had the AC on a while ago. Okay, in that video, I did not give any kind of medical advice. I just gave my uh, experiences on what I do in my personal life. I gave you my opinion on 
things dealing with masks. I gave you my opinion on the biblical aspects of this new medicine that is out. And I in no way encourage or discourage anybody from taking the medicine if they choose to or choose not to. I gave my opinion on certain things based on information that I have. That is publicly accessible. I did not give any medical information on the actual medicine itself, just giving you uh, my opinion on the things that I heard about it. So I don't know how that can be labeled as medical misinformation. I actually went over the video again today to make sure before I filed an appeal. Now, I doubt that our big brothers at YouTube will uh, allow the appeal to go through and actually put the video back on. So like I said, it's on my Rumble channel. And if you're watching this video on my Rumble channel, that link to that video is below. Or you could just go to my my channel on Rumble and look it up. It's called a call for a sway rising. It's interesting to note that um, censorship is real. Like, I don't care what side of the fence you're on. You know, I don't care if you're if you're if you're on the right side or the left side. I it doesn't matter to me. You know, here you know you have a God given right to give your opinion on any subject matter. The fact that Google is a privately owned company and they can get away with censoring people, it's, uh, it's fucked up. It's fucked up. It, it really is fucked up. Like I said, I don't care what side of the fence you're on. I really don't. You have every right to voice your opinion. But when a private company decides to censor you for whatever reason, whether it's good intentioned or not, it doesn't fucking matter. It's wrong. You know, uh, I may not have agreed with everything Trump and others may have said, but he had he has every right to voice it. Um, whether whether somebody's right or wrong on on something, it doesn't matter. They have every right to voice to voice it to say what they want to say. I just I wholeheartedly disagree when any private company takes it upon themselves to create what they call a platform and then try to censor people. And I got to agree with many others who say that once you start censoring people, you're no longer a platform, you are a publisher. It is it is a fucked up situation when anybody tries to censor anybody. I don't care what side of the fence you're on. If you try to censor somebody, you're you're wrong. That's my opinion on it. That's simple. 
I don't care what side of the fence you're on. If you try to censor anybody, you're wrong. When Christians try to censor non-Christians and try to stop them from saying what they feel, believe, and what have you, what have you I call them out on it. I let these ministers, ministers with the quotations, know you're fucking wrong. It is someone's right, absolute right to voice their opinion, voice their concerns, voice even, even just to make themselves look like a fucking idiot by making a statement that makes no sense. I don't care who you are. I don't care how rich you are. I don't care whatever. Anytime you try to censor anybody. You're wrong. Period. That simple. So to. Our big brothers at YouTube. Stop censoring people. Damn. Stop using all these excuses of what have you to censor people. That's all it is, is excuses because you want to censor people. You want to censor people without looking like a jackass. You want to censor somebody without looking like the bad guy. Regardless of what your intentions are, you are the bad guy because you are censoring somebody. You are the bad guy just by censoring somebody, I don't give a fuck what your intentions are, whether they're positive or negative or what have you. You are absolutely fucking wrong. All right, I'm just keeping it short today, but I just wanted to let y'all know that if you want to see that video, that video is on my Rumble channel. And that link to that video is in the description box below. Again, don't forget to uh, hit like, hit subscribe, hit the notification icon so you can be notified of every time that I post a video. Until next time, I'm Sway. I love you all. Peace.